Hello there, home buyers. It's Katie Kerr here, and I want to give you the latest update on the Dreamfall program that just came in from CalHafa. This time around, there's going to be 255 million allocated for this program, and there are four major changes. The last one to me is shocking. So the first one is the whole registration uh, process. So buyers would be able to go and uh, pre-register, enroll, and if they qualify, they'll be able to um, be entered into a lottery system based on the geographic location of where they live. And if they're picked, kind of like having a golden ticket, they'll be able to use that ticket or voucher to be able to go shop um, during a certain amount of time. So that's the first update. The second one is that the income limits have been reduced from 150% area median income um, limit to 120%. So to give you an example, in Santa Clara County, that is going from 300,000 to 277,000 per year. And in Sacramento County, that goes from 250,000 to uh, $180,000 per year. The third one is that there's a maximum purchase price of $800,000. The maximum assistance is limited to 20% or up to $150,000, whichever one is lower. The fourth one, which to me is the most surprising change, is that this is only eligible for first generation home buyers. And that is defined as Buyers who have never owned a home um, in the US, that their parents or legal guardian have not owned a home in the last 10 years, unless they've been in the, unless they grew up in the foster care system. So that could really uh, dis exclude a lot of people um, because maybe there's a lot of first time home buyers where their parents have owned a home. So um, that may be a little bit harder to qualify. However, don't let that discourage you because we all understand that the benefits of homeownership and you know why you were looking into owning a home. Um, there are other first time homebuyer programs where there are lower down payment, down payment assistance, shared equity or grants. So if you have any questions about that, please reach out to me and I'd be happy to help. Um, in regards to the dream for all, let's say you think that you might still qualify for this. In January, there's going to be the announcements and documents that will be um, distributed and also around in this early springtime. That's when the applications will be open for registration. But until then, I will keep you updated if there's anything else that comes up and reach out to me anytime.